Alright, so we're going to learn about static checking. The Java programming language has static typing. So Java programs will not compile if a variable is assigned to an incorrect type. This is a bug, specifically a type declaration bug. So bugs are dangerous. They cause our code to crash or produce incorrect results. Static typing helps because bugs are caught during programming rather than the execution of the code. The program will not compile if the declared type of variable does not match the type of assigned value. And the string hello world cannot be held in the type int. For example, we see the error in the console. String can now be converted to int. <clears throat> when bugs are not caught at compilation, they interrupt execution of the code by causing runtime errors. The program will crash. Java static typing helps developer programmers avoid runtime errors and thus have much safer code that is free from bugs. All right, now, in mess.java, which is this file, we have declared a bunch of variables with the wrong type. Try to uh, compile the file. So let's use uh, the terminal here to compile it. Java C, mess.java. We can see a bunch of errors right here, four of them actually. And I'll also create you guys another thing. Uh, so if you so this is the name of the file right here, and then this number is the is the uh, line that the error is happening. So for example three, so this is happening on line three. So if you have a long line of code or over three hundred three thousand lines of code, uh, you can simply just look at the line here and go to that line instead of searching for us. So, uh, that's another tip. <clears throat> now, change the types of the variables so that they cor correspond with the type assignment values. For example, year is assigned to 2001, so it should be named. All right. So this is an int. This is a string. This is car. Double. And then, of course, this is a boolean. Now compile the file again. Look at how it compiles with no errors. So again, we'll do Java C. So Java C means Java compile, and then mess dot Java. And voila, and that is it going to be. Uh, so that is going to be it for this video. Uh, in the next video, I'll teach you guys naming. Um, until then, have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.